In the last 10 years, 329 children under the age of five drowned in Australia. And swimming pools continue to be the location with the highest number of drowning deaths. If you're one of the over 300,000 backyard swimming pool owners in New South Wales, then you'll want to be sure that young children who swim in your pool are safe from danger. You need to log on to www.swimmingpoolregister.nsw.gov.au from now until October 29, 2013 and register your pool. When you register your backyard swimming pool, you can check your pool safety standards and barriers to make sure that young children can enjoy themselves free from dangers. Once you're on the register, your council can send you up-to-date safety information, as well as arrange a pool safety inspection. The register will ask you to identify your address, what type of pool you own, and the age of the pool. You can also check that your swimming pool barrier meets safety requirements. All states and territories in Australia require water to be fenced, if it is intended for human aquatic activity and is deeper than 300 millimetres. You are also required to display a resuscitation poster around your backyard swimming pool. You have until October 29, 2013 to meet your obligations and register your pool. Don't leave it until summer. Log on to www.swimmingpoolregister.nsw.gov.au and register now to avoid any fines. If you don't have access to the internet, you can register at your local council. You wouldn't think twice about following road rules to make sure children are safe. Don't leave pool safety to chance. It's time to register. Be sure. Be pool safe. Visit www.swimmingpoolregister.nsw.gov.au and register your pool before the 29th of October. You can also download a swimming pool register fact sheet. For further information on pool safety, visit www.bepoolsafe.com.au.